boys. How are you all today? Welcome back to Best Burger Reviews. Uh, we are at Ted's Montana Grill and they actually asked me if I wanted beef or bison and I, I don't like bison too much. But we're on uh, 6th Avenue. It's right next to where we just were, the Capitol Grill, 6th and a half Avenue, 5th, West 51st Street, I believe. Um, and uh, I, don't know, I would definitely get beat up in there. You know, thankfully there were no customers when we were cracking our jokes. But uh, second honorary onion ring review. So we got onion rings and fries. Soggy fries. I don't really want to rate them. Now the onion rings we had at Junior's, I didn't rate those either because they were all bread. Are onion rings supposed to be all bread? These are actually not bad. Because the onion inside is pretty big. Could use a little more salt. I don't know. Onion rings, solid 7.5. We're kind of lucky today. We got like how I like them, you know, just bun, patty, cheddar cheese on top, nice sized bun. But appearance can be deceiving. This is like if PJ Clark's put cheese on their burger, but they overcooked it a little bit. So, and then I gave PJ Clark's a 7.5. And the only reason I like this so much is because I haven't had a good bun today. And, and guys, I haven't had good buns all year, to be honest. Did you get that joke, Rio? Did you fucking get it? You understand? But it's pretty good. I'll get, you know, I'm feeling generous, this review. I'm gonna give it a 7.3. I think if these people knew how to cook a fucking medium rare burger, you know, I was on the phone and she was like, do you want it medium rare or do you want it rare? I was like, eh. And I usually go medium rare because sometimes once in a while when I order it rare, they give me a raw burger and I like it raw. That's too many jokes this video, but usually sometimes they undercook it. So I decided to go medium rare, but this, this is like a well done burger. So I'm not a fan. Yeah, 7.3 is a fair score. I will say, the bun is really good. I like the cheese a lot. Patty could be done a little better though. You know, it's interesting. All these burgers, they, they kind of mess up on one component and it just throws them off. And, then, and the burgers that were really close, like mid-high sevens, just weren't good enough to be an eight. So that's our review for Ted's Montana Grill. Uh, so, if you guys do want an actual high quality burger, you can go to frankiesprearrangedmeat.com to try our custom best burger blend. And if you're from the South or Midwest, send me an email. I'll give you an additional like 5% discount or something for being so horrible with my accent to make it fun of you guys. You can also get a variety of high quality cheeses to pair with your burger for yourself and your lovely Southern family. I'm sorry guys, I'll stop. Mm -hmm.